I was just making a quick video just doing a, a 60 watt solar panel showdown um, for the charge controllers on these units so um, just going to be comparing these three units today so basically first up we got the Jackery 160 this one doesn't have an MPPT um, then we're going to do the Jackery 240 and this is a, a newer 240 that does have MPPT and then we're going to try um, uh, compare that to the Blue Eddy EB55 EB55 and uh, this of course does have an MPPT as well this one's going to be at a slight disadvantage because I got this like three foot uh, adapter cord um, for the solar panel so um, it might be down you know a watt or so just from um, you know basically the voltage drop over the over the uh, the length of that cord but let's see you know let's see what happens all right, here's the solar panel we're going to be using today. This is just a 60 watt. I believe the name is, or the brand name is TP Solar. It's 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 a uh, it's an older solar panel, a couple of years old. So um, you know nothing special, it just folds in half, and uh, it has a, a 5521 output on it. So I am using some adapters for the for the Jackery as well, but um, you know those adapters are not. Um, the same length as the EB55's adapter that we're going to be using today. All right, so first up, the the old Jackery 160. No, no MPPT on this thing or anything, right? So um, yeah, 31 watts. That's still not too bad. And um, you know, this isn't peak solar either. This is like uh, about three or four in the afternoon. So um, so yeah, not too bad. Let's uh, let's unplug this one. And uh, let's just jump right on over to the 240 and uh, plug that in right quick. See what we got. 36 watts. Okay. So five, you know, five more watts, right? And that's actually what, about uh, 15, 15% more or something like that, right? Just trying to do the math real quick something like that so that's actually um, you know a pretty good uh, pretty good bump on it right now let's uh, let's not wait around let's uh, unplug it and uh, actually I'm gonna have to set this down just to uh, hook these up real quick alright so I just plugged that in real quick let's see what we got 34 watts okay so um, so actually like I said probably it would be about the same as the Jackery 240, but we are using that um, extra adapter cord, so we're probably getting we're probably losing a, a watt or so across that cord. So um, pretty similar, but um, but yeah. So uh, the Jackery does win this test, and this is just another good example of why um, you kind of when you're charging from solar, you kind of want to have the shortest um, cabling possible, because um, even though this um, this extra cord I'm using is actually 